Oh, my back. Oh, my legs. Oh, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I'm starving, so I'm eating right now, but I also had no time today, so guess what? <laughs> We're also making a video. How are you guys doing? You guys doing good? Hopefully. So just in case this is your first time seeing the show, hello. I just try not to grin. Uh, it literally means nothing. You can laugh whatever, whatever you want. Also, I'm basically just a glorified uh, narrator who occasionally gives his opinion and regrets it. <clears throat> when you buy air, but half of the bag is filled with cups. I don't understand. I'm just gonna eat my sandwich and move on. Mm. Employer, what are your hobbies, guy? I watch a lot of Hababa. Employee, um, okay. Let's try another question. What is your greatest strength? The guy, my right arm. Okay. Employee. Okay. Leave. <laughs> Please leave. Hello. I think I read this one. Hello. Hey, I need you help. A guy is sending me messages whom I hate the most. Please tell me how to block someone in Facebook. Okay. I will help you. Go to the profile more. Oh, thanks. It's okay. Blocked. Okay, none of these have been funny so much as like, I mean, all right, <laughs> again, another thing that has happened, okay. <laughs> also, any sandwich looks giant in my hands, I know. Y'all might not remember, but Winnie the Pooh keeps a strap at all times. What? Pooh balanced out with the do-rag and the tool. Also, my guys, not a do-rag, a sleeping cap, and the gun was a cork gun that could only go two, two feet. <laughs> <laughs> like it was okay you shoot it and then it goes nope and then stops completely inefficient maybe if you had a little brother who pointed it right at your eye and was able to get the feet of distance before it retracted or just like you know got strung up then maybe dangerous but even then yeah what i'm saying is pooh bear is just not a smart man okay <laughs> he would need to get point blank and it would do nothing to the person he's shooting at oh i don't want when you realize habba aren't really in your area you have stolen my dreams and my childhood. <laughs> Alright, this is pretty good. Eating, eating and laughing is just a good time. Jojo things. Ah, my love for tabletop roleplay games. Me pouring that out. Anyone who listens, <laughs> take it off. <laughs> Hey Kyle, I listen. I always listen. I always like that stuff too. I really like talking about like stories though. Like though I, I might upload it because we were farming some stuff in Borderlands 3 and I was just talking to you guys about like I we ended the stream basically and I was just standing there and I was just talking to you guys about DMOD for like a good 30 minutes. It was a whole thing. Good time. <laughs> Solid time. Friend, how are things in the military? Me. They're good. Narrator. Things were not good. <laughs> Things were for very bad. Pop smoke. What is that? <laughs> what is pop smoke? My pets fall asleep in a cave position. <laughs> Me. <laughs> dude. Dude, I have like a thousand images on my phone of my pet in various per positions just hanging out. Sometimes his whole, he's like, he's off the couch. His hell head. And I'm just like, this is great. And then when I'm clearing out my phone, I'll be like, I have too many of these, but I can't part with any of them. But if I plug my phone to the computer, then it's just going to have to download iTunes update. Now, who has got time for that? And also, it always takes like 50 years because apparently something's on my phone that's just like, guess what? No, it's going to take an eon. So then ultimately, I just, I just, I delete something. <laughs> I delete something of greater importance, but not really because who doesn't love your pets? Awake. But at what cost? <laughs> at what cost, my guy? Also... Ugh. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm a mug of the sitting. Hope you guys are eating with me, so I'm just not a freak eating alone. You're watching me, then it gets a bit weird. But if you're eating with me, then we're just, just hanging out. Ooh, someone different, zero imp. What do you got for me? This is so awesome. It's the last day of the fourth, fourth grade, and we don't have to do any work all afternoon. The teacher just wheeled in the TV and we get to choose between The Incredibles and <laughs> Shrek. I know it's supposed to be Shrek, but Incredibles is pretty amazing. Uh, this happened, I think, twice <laughs> in my whole school life experience. So, 
Yeah. <laughs> go, go team, I guess. Also, solid first meme here. Or at least the one that I've seen. Sorry. <laughs> Anyways. When you... When the G falls off of a graveyard sign. Graveyard sign? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What is this? Her. I thought you said you were interested. Him. No, Cameron. I said I was into resting? Oh, into resting. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, Karen. Get away from me. I just want to sleep. <laughs> Always Karen. <laughs> Poor Karen's of the world. I bet you're just lovely. <laughs> and there's just a bunch of <laughs> horrible people. <laughs> Wakes up before alarm goes off. Me. Please don't be six. Clock. 5.59. One minute from six. Me for the rest of the day. I don't really. What do you mean? So you wake up. You wake up like a. I always do that. You wake up like a minute before your alarm. You're just hovering over it like. Bah, 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 before even before you yell at me, I got you. My problem is after you've won the battle is to be like. I could just like. Oh, I could just go. I could just lay back down and I'd just do it for a second. I'm out. <laughs> I'm out for the rest of the day. I'm like, oh no. That's why you know. That it's a failed battle, one that you can never win, so you always gotta get back up, or just get, just all the way up, don't even, don't even hesitate, don't think about anything else, all the way up. Your 20s are such a wild time, man, because all your friends have different mindsets. Some are parents, some haven't paid for a single thing, and some are blacked out every time you see them. Well, I feel attacked, because <laughs> I have none of these. <laughs> I have me. And a, a person that I keep in contact with, high school, we talk every like month for two hours, and that's about it. And we all that we generally feel the same way. This this sucks. This is awesome. That's unfortunate. Oh no. Oh good. Okay, no, I'm back to no. All right. <laughs> and it's just a back and forth pattern. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this. Part of me is like okay, and the other part of me is like. Ah. <laughs> ah. What did this? Oh, I can't read it because it's so small. I had a feeling this might happen, so I made sure to bring the gag and rope. Okay, I, mean, I appreciate the anime. I, I don't really. Okay. Also, I never got the appeal of that. You know what? I I I want to be doing let. Like, I don't understand. <laughs> Why do you want to be like locked in and not being able to move? I would I would bite someone. <laughs> If, if this was ever a thing like where you're with your missus and then you wake up and then she's like I wanted to try this thing I would I would like start bashing my head against the wall like I'll kill me I'll kill me if you don't let me get out I don't like being claustrophobic or mound up in any way oh, I'll be the worst dude I don't know why <laughs> no, maybe that's it is that you are like surrendering control I want that I want all control I don't want any of that what is this don't make excuses for nasty people you can't put a flower in an ababa and call it a vase. Don't you know my, you don't know my life? <laughs> also, yikes. Yikes. Thanos. You, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh? Yeah, Yu-Gi-Oh. Uh, uh, what do you call it? Go, uh, ultimate form or god form Goku or whatever it's called. Yeah, and, and of course Thanos with the mustache. Or, and Thanos and Mario. And is he holding a Zelda? No, he's holding a key sword, I think. Yeah, he's holding a key sword. I don't think disappointed. Wish you had more. Wish you, wish you really layered it on. All right, Brock. What are you saying? The fact that I have more clothes to sleep in than I do to go out in says a lot about who I am as a person. It's just kind of a statement. And uh, yeah, no, I have, I have like, I have, I mean, I have pajamas. So I think also that's not fair because that's one of the things. Like, if you just don't buy clothes for yourself, you don't go out and shop. Um, then that's like the easiest gift for your mom or your parents or your friends to get you for Christmas or any of your birthdays is like here's some pajamas and some boxers <laughs> and some shorts or whatever like it's never like here's a t-shirt with, with like a really high quality fabric so it doesn't feel like cotton scraping across your chest <laughs> instead it's like hey here's just some pajamas because <laughs> I don't know what you are or what you like I've been holding on to this sandwich for such a long time now. <laughs> when the higher ups hear someone use common sense, <laughs> oh my God, ah, ah, burns. <laughs> or at least is he spitting up? He's about to spit up his, I don't know. <laughs> uh, wet paint. Wet paint, wet paint, wet paint. Oh, there, that's the editing guy, right? I guess he's using yeah, 
Hey, what do you call it? He's using a, uh, a green screen and green paint, I think. Oh, that'd be still really hard to render, though. Yeah, you can see it when he reaches it, when he does his hand over there. Yeah, <laughs> you can see that there's a thing. Anyways, cool. Very cool. Oh, no, I remember this. It's a Grinch. <laughs> um, him. I bet you look beautiful when you wake up. Me, <laughs> when I wake up. <laughs> it's like, at the very least, cute. A little bit of terrifying, but still cute. I can see where he's coming from. Look at those eyes and or eyelashes. Oh, me. Oh, that was a good sandwich. I gotta exercise in three hours. All righty. Let's continue, right? Or are we? No, we're fine. Okay. <clears throat> My kid. Can we go to the... Me. Tomorrow we can. My kid, as soon as I open my eyes, I summon you to fulfill your oath. <laughs> yeah, I remember that. Because in a kid's mind, that's the only thing he's thinking about the whole day. There's this one thing. So for you as a parent, to just be like, okay, well, maybe we can put it off. is horrible. Because the kid has, you have, like, as a parent, you probably have a thousand things going on. Like, oh, I gotta pay the bills. I gotta go to work. I gotta do this at work. I gotta, I gotta do this at the house. He has got one central view, and that is the park, in which he can he can show you that he can do this weird thing on the monkey bars, and then it's just like, okay, and then you gotta act impressed. I have nephews, okay? <laughs> it's a whole thing. My alarm at 6 a.m. Me. Who thought it was a good idea to stay up until 3 a.m.? <laughs> Smash! <laughs> You're a fool. Yeah, I felt that a lot. It's it was it's like a never-ending battle, because uh, I'm just like a I'm just bred to be a, a night person. But then again, uh, yeah, I was also one of those people that were like, it's impossible for me to get to sleep on time. But that's also shitty, because it's entirely possible, although it's very hard. But you can do a thousand things that help you get to that place. So if I could like tell my past self to be like, hey. Listen, I know you're saying it's impossible, but it's actually not. It's just challenging. But if you really get this down pat, and you always go to sleep at the right time, and you always do these these things, and then on the days that you can't do it anymore, you take a sleeping pill, then that's fine. But just don't always take the sleeping pill, because yeah. I've just seen this. Uh, do, uh, do you have any hobbies? Introvert, TV, sleeping, and then the fridge. <laughs> the fridge food. Um, I seen this, what do you call it? one of the comments was kind of interesting because it was like, it was my dumb brain where like as much as this is a joke and a meme and all these funny things, at the same time, my brain's like, well, th that's not entirely true. Like you being an introvert, in introverted person just means you don't like to be out in the public and, and constantly being around people all the time. And like, I think introvert is literally a person that, that like it's taken, energy gets taken away from you when you're in, in a social s situation, not not gained, which is an extrovert. Introverts gain energy and, and, and joy from being in social environments. Introverts feel drained, which I am one of, but I'm a weird hybrid because <laughs> I love hanging out with people, but I also get drained by them. Anyways, one of the comments I read in the, in the post when I seen this was a person saying, like, dude, you're just lazy. <laughs> you're not even an introvert. You're just lazy. <laughs> like, you just, you sleep and you watch TV. That's not an introvert. Like, like, anything. You could learn a book. You could, you could do any of these things and you'd still qualify as being an introvert. You gotta get out and do some shit, my guy. <laughs> you alone? Yeah, why? What's up? Well, I'm in the shower. Want to help me out? You, you don't know how to take a shit. Yeah, I seen it. I seen it. This is all well and good until the airbag uh, malfunctions, moisture damage, and your passenger takes a, a cactus, a cactus to the face at 200 miles per hour. Also, I don't know if that's how that works. The, the airbag malfunctions from water. I don't, I'm not sure. I feel like it wouldn't. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know the chemical compounds that are affected by that, but I don't know why moisture would affect the release pressure and all that maybe but the point being is that your point still stands where if you did crash your vehicle you're still getting a, sh a bunch of shrapnel <laughs> all up in your your shit then again maybe this dude has sprayed some sort of like adhesive all around it so that it just stays together in a clump it's not better for this the guy who's in the the passenger side but at least the guy who's driving won't get a bunch of shit flying at him too <laughs> and he's gotta drive and manage i don't know maybe going down a hill <laughs> i don't know but what I do know, ladies and gentlemen, is thank you so much for your time. I'm not even sure if I'll upload this because I've been eating in most of it. Uh, and maybe that's just really vile and gross, but maybe you made me not feel so weird and you actually got some food yourself and we're nibbling on things while we were looking at happy fun time memes. Who knows? Thank you so much for your time. Subscribe button right here as well as two videos further that way. Thank you and goodbye.